Hello everybody, and in this video I will be drawing a great white shark. This is definitely by far the most feared animal in the world, but they really are. But the truth is, they're getting a bad rap because they're not as deadly and horrifying and evil as some people think they are. And in fact, they're not evil at all. They're just creatures trying to survive. In fact, the truth is, they don't even eat people. They accidentally do it, but, you know, like, um, no, they don't accidentally eat people. They accidentally bite people, and the only way people actually die is from blood loss. Well, today I am going to show you how to draw one of these scary animals, which is also my favorite animal. So, um, for this drawing, you kind of want to start out with a line like this, you know, pretty simple. And, um... Then you just kind of want to come up like this, you know. And if I ever go too fast, please do pause the video and, um, you know. Okay, so you kind of want to, and draw lightly, you know, very, very lightly. Okay, good. Now you want to come down like this. Okay, you might be able to figure out what part of the shark this is right now. Um, okay, hold on. This is why you want to do it lightly, because just in case if you need to erase anything, it's um, not as bad. But, um, yeah. That'll do, because once I shade, I can hide that. And plus, maybe it'll be a, like a little scarf, a scar on the shark. Mm. But there are many, many animals much deadlier than this animal, like scorpions, hippos, crocodiles, even some elephants, even African elephants, Cape buffalo, lions, you know. <clears throat> but the deadliest animal is obviously, you might be able to guess that, humans. Why wouldn't we be the deadliest animal? We have guns, weapons, we could even create we we could even create st we cause great destruction. But there is one animal in particular that causes the most deaths. It's mosquito. And um I'm still trying to figure out if they're even dangerous because you know, it's the parasite that kills you. Well, you know, um let me know in the comments what you think about that, but um anyway, so obviously you can tell that this is the fin of the shark and yes um it kind of looks weird right now because trust me I'm a shark expert you might think it looks weird the fact that the head's right here and the fins right here you know but um just hang on hang in for a little bit trust me you will see there are different angle views where you can see and then you kind of see how this all just forms at the end Okay, so this shark is obviously going to be coming out of the water. You see that? And, um... So yeah, his head's poking out of the water. He probably spots a seal or something. But I find sharks fascinating. I've been studying them for a while. And in fact, great whites actually aren't the deadliest shark. I think there might be the second deadliest, but the deadliest shark is actually the bull shark. Why bull sharks? They may not be bigger, but they certainly are more aggressive. Much more aggressive. In fact, possibly the most aggressive animal there is. <sighs> and again, they probably don't try and eat you. They'll just maybe try and test bite you to see if you're edible. And yes, you might be edible, but sharks don't really like the taste of us, which is a good thing, because if they wanted to, they could certainly. But yeah, just blood loss, stuff like that is why. But at least sharks don't try to kill us purposely. Well, maybe like when they see us, but then eventually they'll realize we're bad. 
that's what's hard about being a shark, is they have a super hard time distinguishing between what they like and what they don't like. And what they don't, one of the things they don't like is people. If they were to know, then there probably wouldn't be any shark attacks. I mean, maybe if they feel threatened, but, you know, they would just do it in self-defense. Okay, so now you kind of see, I don't know if you're able to see yet, but, um, while we're at it, let's fix this a bit. Let's try and give this a little bit more angle so you can kind of see how it's a bit, it looks exaggerated, but um, eventually you'll be able to see why it's kind of like this. You'll definitely be able to know that this has where the mouth goes. Now let's lower that a bit. <sighs> so, you know. No, uh, no, let's make it more of an arch shaped. <laughs> yep. Even the little things you gotta be careful about. And great white sharks are actually starting to become endangered. They really are. Which isn't good. People think without sharks, there the world would be a better place. You really think that? Sure. Sharks actually help the ocean. They get rid of they eat trash. Some types of sharks like tiger sharks eat trash that people don't even care about and just throw in. Like treating the world like it's their own trash can. You know, people these days, something else. Okay, this may look weird right here, but yeah, you just gotta hang in with me, remember. Just like for this, you might be able to see, you might be able to start seeing how it's forming, but trust me, hang in there. I know what I'm doing. And, um, after the video, I would really appreciate if you subscribe to me. Then I could make more draw. then... If you subscribe to me, I'll make more drawing videos. And other videos. You could maybe, hey, if you want, you could tell me what you'd like me to draw. And if you do, I, I might do it. It's a good chance I will do it, but you have to tell me. It could be anything. Anything at all. Or, if you have a favorite animal, tell me, and I'll teach you how to draw it. Just like I'm teaching you right now how to draw my favorite animal, which is obviously the great white shark. Out of all sharks, this is my favorite, I guess because they're the coolest looking in my opinion, I don't know. Okay, um, so just kind of, you know, we're going to kind of come back with that, with like a little splash, bit of splashing, so just hang on with that. And then, um... Yeah, you know, let's let's make this a bit wider, you know. Okay. Yeah. Okay, so then you kinda wanna just come in like this. And also, great white sharks aren't even the deadliest animal in the ocean. Nope, they're not. I believe the deadliest animal in the ocean is the box jellyfish. Extremely venomous. In fact, it's the most venomous animal, the box jellyfish. Ooh, hoo, hoo. And just like any jellyfish, it doesn't bite you, it will sting you. Actually... Let's raise this up a bit. My bad. Sorry, guys. Remember, draw this light so that you'll know when a mistake comes.
I am using a really crappy eraser. Okay, so basically just draw the fin again here. And um, when we come back to shade, we will easily get rid of all these mistakes. You could probably tell that uh, he's just now like coming out of the water like. Okay, now we're going to start to add the splashes. Okay, so kind of come here. Yeah. Okay, don't worry about these if you ever made these mistakes. Just more worry about this right here. Yeah, you know, just leave it, leave it alone. Okay, now you want to come back here and... Okay, this, yeah, remember, just hang in with me. You will see. And if you want, you can kind of make your own little random lines right here. We'll come back. Okay, then. And start making like splashes right here. You know, do your own little shapes. Come back in here, draw little bubbles. I don't know, I don't care. <laughs> Just anything that may look like splashing. Then kind of add it like coming out, like it's really rising. Rise, rise, and then just kind of right here, like um. Okay, now right here, kind of gonna make it look like it's fading back into the water, so you know, like um, and then just like make some splashing around it. I don't know because it's kind of just like rising out of the water that way. The splashing's more below the shark than like all around because you know it's not like completely out of the water. You will only be able to see a little bit of it out. Okay. And it's okay if that leaves a little bit because actually in fact you kind of want it to. Because you just want because you don't want it to be solitary because it's splashing. You kind of want it to be a little bit see-through. Because it is clear color. I mean, it does kind of do that. And yes, as you may have known, this would be where the gills are. So if you want to do some gills, yeah, you, you probably should. The only reason you wouldn't is if you want the splashing to cover it, but I'd prefer not, so. You probably should do what I do. <laughs> do what I do. Well, yeah, of course, but like, you know. Alright then, you want to come back here, and um, you want to do those little gums, get ready for the teeth. The number one thing about this animal people fear the most is those teeth. Those teeth that they think are soon going to be filled with blood when they come attack you. And when you end up in their stomach. Ugh, people these days. They're so scared of sharks they don't even want to study them. And that's okay, you don't have to. But it can be helpful because it helps you find out the truth about these animals. People find them too scary to be to admit that they're fish, but they really are. They've got the same basics. I mean, think about it. Sure, their fins aren't like, you know, tucked in and everything, but it's basically the same stuff. So, you know, yeah. Mm -hmm. and I've been studying sharks for a long time. So, that's how I'm an expert at them. 